Welcome back. By now, you should have done interviews with lots of potential customers. So this week, we'll cover how to distill insights from these interviews and determine how best to address the customer needs and position yourself on the market. First, gather your interview notes and group them by customer segment. Then, write the key insights from each interview on a post-it note. If possible, use different color post-its for positive versus negative insights towards the need you're trying to address. You may want to add post-its for other considerations for each customer group, such as their market size. Gather similar post-it notes within a customer segment, such as for the needs, where the customer has the need, or specific features that might address the need. Next, see which group of customers has more positive insights. You may be able to see if the needs of customer segments have overlaps, but you should still be choosing one customer group for your target customer. Remember the Lamborghini example and the value of focus. Overlaps will just give you the potential opportunity to grow down the road. If you're having trouble choosing your target customer, see if there's more information that would help you decide, and do more interviews if you need to. Next, you'll develop a customer persona. This will be one person within your target market from your interviews who has the biggest unmet need, who you'd be able to develop an offering to meet that need and who would be willing to spend the time and money to find a solution. This is like Giovanni from the Lamborghini case study, where Bill could list his lifestyle, income, places he liked to go, things he wore, everything. The value of choosing one person for this is it allows everyone in your company to align around the vision of who your customer is. Plus, it allows you to refer back to and even ask this person when you need to make decisions.